everybody, welcome to Tower Pals. I'm Tower Paw, and this is Anna Uzumaki. How's it going? Today we are playing a game that I'm pretty sure will get more views than our other gameplays because of our reputation, but... Yeah, it is, re it is relevant, at least, to what we do. So, <laughs> we're gonna be doing Twilight Princess, a, a video game that both, uh, both Paul and I have both made an entire video series about. Mine being a horrible pile of shit that I honestly can't watch anymore without cringing. <laughs> if and you still... mine being the latest thing I've done, but... I don't know if this video is going to come out before my Skyward Sword episode does, but, eh, whatever. Yeah, it'll be, it'll at least be interesting to revisit this game. I haven't played it in months. Oh, uh, yeah. I haven't played it in a couple of years. <laughs> yeah, because people... I don't, have... think, I don't think I played it once during the entire time I was making the series, and I've been making that series for about three years, so... Yeah. Well, <laughs> it's been making, a while. I mean, I say, ma well, making with quotation marks. More like, oh shit, it's been like two months. I better actually, like, make a fucking video or something. Yeah. So you want to jump right into this, or anything else you want to add before we, uh... uh before we... No, I think we're good to start. Yeah, let's do it. So we, we have kind of a thing. Uh, bo both of us have already selected, uh... We've done a little recording ahead of time to try to... Basically a practice recording, so we're both gonna be... Well, we, it was kind of disorganized and shit, so we both decided, like, which characters we're going to read for, uh, when we get to them. So... And I, you'll find, I guess you'll figure that out when we actually get around to doing that. So, mm -hmm. ready, man? Without further ado. Yeah. Which one should we, uh. Which well, one it's, should it, we start with? It is such an important decision. Yes. Uh, which save file should we go start with? First? Well, do you, want to get the, do you want to get the good ending? Or? Uh. Sure. <laughs> just, no, I, no, I want the bad ending. I want the okay. piece of shit ending. Go with number, go with number one, because that's okay. the loveliest number. Uh, Alright. So I have an idea for, uh, how about you name him, uh, n name him Slave. <laughs> uh, kind of simplistic, isn't it? Yeah, I, th I think it'll be funny. You, you can name him whatever you want to, Well, but, uh, I guess when we have Midna, it's gonna be pretty, uh... <laughs> I don't know, I see, I think everybody else... Yeah. I feel everybody else, though, when they con come into contact with him, I feel it'll be quite relevant. Hello, Slave! Can you get me some items? <laughs> Yeah, there you go. <laughs> All right, so end. All right, now Epona. You can name her if you want, but I here I'll just I'll just throw out my thought, and if you want to change things, you can. So I was thinking, um, your car. <laughs> that sounds good. Hey Link, I'm washing your car for you. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. It could it could this could very much backfire. We don't know. Uh, I doubt it. <laughs> yeah. But I see, it's, see. it's it's, it's kind of like a name, so I I don't see I see it working in a lot of situations. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. Or, uh, excellent. We're ready to start this adventure. All right. Brightness check. Change the settings on the screen so that the three shapes below appear as squares. If you fail if you fail to do so, your game will explode. Um. Quick question. Why would they appear as anything else but squares? <laughs> Um, how, how, how dark is your... If it's just one big rectangular shape, uh, then you probably don't have your TV on. You need to adjust that. But, but there wouldn't be anything else but squares, no matter how bright it is or how dark it is. I don't know. You don't know what happens when it gets dark. Your imagination I, I, starts I, I to... Don't, I don't hurt. understand that. I guess the second one is uh, makes more sense if the... Uh, Screen is too dark to see clearly. Just adjust the settings so that the four colors on the right are distinct. Well, maybe it's a translation thing, but it, it, it this was released in the late 2000s, so I don't think that was uh... the late 2000s. I don't know what I meant by that. I meant more recent. <laughs> so in 2000, 92, right? <laughs> 2096 in the future. Just no. <laughs> I don't. This I game is it. that advanced, people. <laughs> like after I said. All right. Well, so Let's move on before we uh, bore the people with this yeah. one screen. I'll be amused. Ah, uh, we open up at a peaceful. Tell me, do you ever feel a strange sadness as dusk falls? Not really. They say it's the only time when our world intersects with theirs. You know, you just kind of started talking for no reason next to me. What? What, what are you talking about? The only time we can feel the lingering regrets of spirits. Who have left our world. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I'd like if Link just turned towards him and he's like, 
Yeah, that's really poetic and all, but I I was asking you why the fuck are you making me do your job for you again and deliver <laughs> shit viral? And then you just started saying all this bullshit about things, and then he's like, "It reminds me when I was a child. Lo, those many." <laughs> it's like ah, for fuck's sake. <laughs> gets up and leaves. Oh, uh, this is why loneliness always right, no. it's the hour of twilight. Great. Now people are gonna demand that you do a Twilight Princess remake and put oh. that as your intro. <laughs> Fuck no. <laughs> I could just see that happening. Fuck no. I'm not. No. <laughs> okay, but enough talk of sadness. I have a favor to ask of you, slave. <laughs> okay. There you go. It's I very you. it's very good to have that as the name. <laughs> Although if I'm a slave, it's not really much of a favor. It's more like I'll beat you if you don't. <laughs> but continue. I was supposed to deliver something to the royal family of Hyrule the day after tomorrow. Look at those blue eyes. I could just get lost in Yeah, them. and I know you're gonna make me do it. Eye. Okay, now. <laughs> yes, it was a task sent to me by the man, but, um, fuck that, I suppose. <laughs> Continue. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, then he doesn't explain why it is he doesn't want to go. Yeah. <laughs> he just is like, you have never been to Hyrule, right? Uh, why are you making yeah. me do your job? Yeah, you've never been there. You should probably go and partake <laughs> in things with your life. In the kingdom of Hyrule, there is a great castle. Yeah, why am I going there again? <laughs> the castle is town and a community far bigger than our little village. <laughs> you're not gonna, you're not gonna answer my question, are you? You're just gonna be a fucking douche. Blah blah blah. Far bigger than Hyrule is the rest of the world the gods created. You should look upon it with all your own eyes. Not this... me, though. I won't be doing that. I'll be at home masturbating. Doesn't need to masturbate. He's got a wife. Have you seen his wife? Actually, she's not that bad. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna aside... say, dude, she's not that aside... bad. <laughs> aside from being, aside from being pregnant, it is getting late. We should head back hotter. to the village. <laughs> I would talk to the man about this matter. So let's go. Let's do it. Let's go, slave. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Why the hell do I put up with this? Why do I have to be mute? I would speak out <laughs> in anger if I could. Now, you were mentioning this last playthrough, but yeah. Epona. Really fucking massive. Yeah. It's, it's it's like Big Mac on steroids. I mean, honestly. I, yeah. Look at the size of that horse. I've been it's... around horses. They are not that big. Yeah, see, he's got first-hand experience. I'm glad we're watching all of this uh, mundane opening of uh, opening of doors. I'm glad they kept this here. No, they they're locking the gate. Uh, it's to show their uh, usual routine. Stop that! That is a fucking huge horse. <laughs> By the way, look at the rainbow. It was nice. Yes, it was quite lovely. But uh, well, I'm glad I always showed that footage of us walking here so I could wave goodbye and go off and do. Irrelevant things. I mean, you'll meet us later, so we probably didn't need to animate all this, but yeah, whatever. There's his son who looks like a daughter. <laughs> yeah. You you had the... Like, with me, it was always Mido from, uh, from Ocarina of Time, where I couldn't tell the fucking gender. Apparently, this is your Mido. <laughs> yeah, I mean, from when I first saw the first trailer, I'm like, that's a... I could have sworn that, that was a girl. And then I'm like, wait. When I played the game, I'm like, wait, that's a boy? Well, ah, here's the... Comes... Yep. Here she Time comes. to fuck up Link's morning. <laughs> yeah, she I just. Know he's... <laughs> it's not like she asks, tells, lets you know, or leaves a note. She's just like, well, just gonna take his horse away from him. Yeah. Like, it's not fuck? like he's gonna need it or anything. Hey, slave, you there? <laughs> 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 no, <laughs> go away. <laughs> <laughs> you don't really have a choice in the matter, there, buddy. <laughs> hey, you man, help me here, the goats. I do mind, but I still have to do it, right? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. You dumb uh, slut. Fine. Hey, what the? Hey, wow, I just noticed that your horse is missing. Have no idea how I didn't notice that until, yeah, like, the you know. <laughs> Where's your car? <laughs> <laughs> I love these choices. I'm so proud of myself now. <laughs> Proud of myself. You have no idea. <laughs> oh, oh, that's that's perfect. Uh, <laughs> Where's your car? <laughs> I told you. I told you this would be awesome. Oh man, but still, he missed the giant fucking yeah. horse. 
It's like Tommy was so walking into the like the flower shop store and she's like, "Oh hi Johnny, I didn't know it was you." Until he was like <laughs> right in front of the register. <laughs> also, yeah. speaking of things that are massive, opponent being massive, this dude right yeah, here. Yeah, this is another thing that Zan and I noticed. Look at how big this guy is. Holy shit. I only come up to his shoulder. I mean, I've always thought of Link as being, you know, uh, a, a pretty tall guy. Whoops. A uh, pretty tall uh, individual. But comparing him to yeah. this guy, it's like, I look like a fucking dwarf. Yeah, because Link's like, Link's like a teenager in this. He's almost, well, he's almost an adult. He's well, either like I, 17 or I think he's like 17 or 18. It's not really distinguished yeah. what he is, but that's usually about right. the, when people are like as big as they're going to get uh, vertically. Yeah, this guy, I wonder if everybody else is this big, because we only noticed it with this guy. Either that or this yeah, guy just... I never starts... really went up to anyone else and uh, measured myself. Right, like, these guys must suffer from fucking gigantism or something. I, yeah, I, I mean... We'll have, to, we'll have to compare to everybody else, but... Yeah, I mean, seriously, and look at that nose. It starts at the very top of his forehead. <laughs> 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 Wonderful nose there, buddy. Hey, so you just gonna stand there, like, staring at me, or you, uh... <laughs> I love his face, too. Look at that face. He's just like, oh, this is getting a little uncomfortable. You, yeah. Uh, you can, I'm, Link's, I you look, to... look at Link's face. Like, he's just like... Eh. <laughs> eh. That guy's just like, uh... uh, uh you gonna go, or... Because even his I mean, eyebrows... I, I... I try to I'd interact with you, but I'm an NPC, so either you gotta fucking press A or just go. <laughs> <laughs> He's so fucking. He looks so sad. <laughs> like you're staring daggers at him. Like it's like I know what you fucking. I know what you fucking did. And he's just like. This is a perfect angle. This is a perfect angle. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to. All right. Let's just uh, go get the horse. We've been dicking around here way too long. Yeah, let's go get the horse. I mean, there's a squirrel <laughs> like, running around so here, but... It's fucking sad, though. Yeah. Squirrel! Yes. I, I keep wondering about this squirrel. Is it like a chipmunk crossed with a squirrel? Because yeah, cause I've have never whole... seen a squirrel with stripes on its back like that. Yeah, because they do have the whole Avatar The Last Airbender thing kind of going on with, like, combinations of animals. I, I was wondering, was that only... I don't know if that was only the gods, but no, that's right, because the... No, the, the goats are a little shaped differently, too. Yeah, so, I don't know. It's interesting. Is my oh, horse under here? No. Hmm. I apologize, I'm eating while recording. Uh, because I want to uphold the highest standards. How unprofessional of you, Xana. Well, I want to uphold the highest standards of professionalism. Uh-huh. Yeah. Well, let's <laughs> go get your car. Yeah. <laughs> <So we> can... <laughs> They've locked the gate! Well, They've locked the gate! That's Credits fine. roll. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right, let's go in here. Uh, seriously, that horse is huge. Yeah. It's like Gigantor the horse. <laughs> Alright. And now we get to see... <laughs> the character that we forget about for about the next many hours of the game. <laughs> and then see briefly and then forget about her again. And now a reenactment of the scene from How to Train Your Dragon. <laughs> <laughs> you know that really dumbass scene? Oh, oh hi, slave! Hi, slave. <laughs> hi, slave. <laughs> and she says it with a smile, too. <laughs> that like, just makes, you know your place. That makes it even more perfect. Yes. I washed, I washed your <laughs> car for you. <laughs> Remember, I'm reading Elia, though. I know, I know. I just... I know. I'm only uh, saying it because I, if you I, talk over me, we can't hear. It cuts off the other person. I know, I know. It's just, with the yeah. names, it's just hard <laughs> not to read it. <laughs> and just laugh at it. So. See, I'm, gl I'm glad we decided to do this again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm much happier with these names. <laughs> Your car is a girl, too. <laughs> so you have, a tr you have to treat her like one. Whoa. <laughs> oh. Whoa. So there are so many movies and TV shows that I've seen where the guys do actually refer to their cars as she's and, you know, yes. treating her right or some bullshit like that. Hey, the car is just like a woman. You fuck them. <laughs> Wait, no. Right on the exhaust pipe. Yep. Uh, you're bringing back memories of our Freddy video, or Freddy movie night <laughs> thing. Ah, uh, nostalgia, man. The car. Oh, but listen, slave. Could you do something for me? 
Can you use a piece of grass to play that song for me? You know, the one that your car likes. <laughs> oh jeez. I don't know if the car. I don't know if the car has uh, the ability to decide that, but okay. <laughs> All right. Time to blow some weed. Yes. That's really that's really good of you to make a to make a drug joke about a drug you've never done before. <laughs> that's how to not. That's how to make yourself not sound like an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> it's such a nice melody. Your car looks happy. Oh, jeez. Like the... F I guess she's looking at the front of it. You know how the front of a car kind of looks like a smile? <laughs> I guess. Well, she's all prettied up now, so I suppose you can ride her back. But don't you ma Don't you make her do too much, okay? Ha! <laughs> uh, Foreshadowing. You know, when I act like a fucking bitch later. Yeah, uh, by the way, Ilya... Stop fucking stealing my horse. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I know you have work today, but fuck you. Yeah. I mean, technically, it's the end of the day, so... That's like if you had, like, if, I mean, if somebody had yeah. work in the morning and, like, my car just never, disappeared. I can never control this stupid horse. I'm terrible at that. I always run into everything. Yeah. Yep. You're playing this on a... Oh, you do, you have to do this on a... Right, you're on an emulator, right? So you are you using a mouse and keyboard? Uh, no. I can't play this with a mouse and keyboard. Well, I could, but it would Is it be a... fucking hard. I'm using an oh. Xbox controller. Right. Okay. By the way, yeah, sorry, we're, pl we're playing on an emulator. I know, bad us, but it's the only way I can actually we, watch We already it. own the game, so who cares? <laughs> right, right. It's just the only way we can possibly... Oh, hi, it, chicken. It's the only way we can record with good quality. Look at this yeah. town. Oh, yeah. It's very tiny. <laughs> this town yes. obviously has not been around for very long. Oh, there's the there's the second, and uh, next to the farmer, that guy down there, the second saddest man in all of Ordon Village. Yeah, look at him. Look at that face. Just even, like, his shoulders are slumped over. He just looks perpetually miserable. Until like, he I starts guess he's... throwing e hawks at you. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 until then, yes. Well, he's got to have some kind of outlet. Uh-huh. He's probably depressed because he's married to the crazy cat lady. <laughs> I'm married to this fat bitch and my daughter who's horny as hell. Seriously. The fuck yeah. with my life. <laughs> and we could talk to these people and get some information, but f fuck them. And there's oh, Mervo! Hey. We are not gonna talk to him yet. <laughs> yeah. Let's do that. Let's We're gonna that. save that for the next time we start recording. Yeah. Because yeah. fuck you people. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, you don't want to give in to blatant fan service. Well, not yet. <laughs> not yet, at least. Soon. Yes. I'm sure, and, and by the way, speaking of fan service, I'm sure you all are aware who's going to voice Zant <laughs> later in this. Well, it could be either of us, for all they know. Could be. Because we both but, have excellent Zant characters. Hey, sorry to get you, get you over here in such a hurry, slave. <laughs> Actually, except I'm not sorry at all, because you work for me, bitch. <laughs> They won't listen to a word I say, because, you know, they're fucking animals. <laughs> and I'm an idiot. Sorry to ask, bud, but uh, how's about you and your uh, car herd him up into the barn real quick? <laughs> well, let's see what, we'll see what this guy's very uh, arbitrary definition of real quick is as we take on this task. By the way, I wonder what would happen if I said no. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, well, okay. I'm betting that with you two help me out. Goddamn phone. Yeah, yeah, I got a text message. I might have to respond to that real quick. Ah, uh, well, when no, you're doing that, I'll be herding around some yes. goats. I can still count. It's not like I can't talk while you're... It's some high-quality shit you're watching. Yeah? <laughs> Just running around and scaring goats. <laughs> hey, ah, mules or goats. Uh, whatever. There we go. Okay, message reply to. That shouldn't be an issue. Alright, now let's uh, Sorry, hopefully that turn. didn't turn. <laughs> ah. So while we're while we're sitting here doing something incredibly monotonous and boring, how do you feel about the tutorial stage? Because I'm come I'm the one who kinda comes from the camp of this goes on way too fucking long and they could have probably introduced you into the action quicker. <laughs> well the whole herding goats thing I think is a little uh irritating, but Yeah. It does get you a, a feel for how to control a Pona. Yeah. Even though you lose your horse and then go along for a lo for a while, not without your horse. Yeah. So kind of makes it a little. Pointless. And I'm not. A, but, and I, I want to. But I do like how you get at least a setup for 
uh, yeah. for like where, like they they set up the area and the life that these people have very well, in my opinion. And I I'm, I kind of you can keep skipping through the dialogue oh. by the way if you want to. Yeah, I don't know. I'm always he and say here's anything a, important. I guess here's where I'm coming from. I'm not a I'm not even really a huge fan. I actually like Ocarina of Time better than A Link to the Past. But I think one thing A Link to the Past did really well was getting you right into the action immediately. Like, you pretty much wake up, it's stormy outside, your uncle goes off for no reason, you fucking find him in there, and it's like, here's a sword, now go kill things and do a do a tutorial temple. It's like, yeah. oh shit. The, the only thing I don't like about that, though, is that there's there feels like less of a story then. Well, it doesn't it doesn't mean there has to be an absence of story. I just I just kind of like to, you know, you typically with, with a story, at least for me, you want to start at the most one of the more interesting points instead of I, I guess they were going for something different here. They wanted you to connect to the villagers or whatever, yeah. which is OK. But I, th I, don't know. I personally, I think it goes well. I just it does seem a little uh, it does. I will agree. It seems a little. Yeah, dragged I mean, out. obviously, we're having fun now Forests. because. Obviously, we're having fun with this now, though, because we can use this as fodder for jokes. Yeah. But, <laughs> Children! <laughs> this sequence. but playing it on my own, it did go on. 